In our next story, we take a look at a newer form of art. Michael Roy is not only a native Mississippian, but he is an alum of the Mississippi School of the Arts and has literally left his mark on the world. He's painted murals in the United States, Germany, Japan, South Korea, Vietnam, Thailand, and recently came back to Brookhaven and painted a mural for his old alma mater. Art to me is like more of this lifestyle thing. The most important aspects of why I make art become the social aspects. Like I like painting outside. I like painting with students here today. I like painting with other painters. It makes you feel more alive, like more connected to each other. My name is Michael Roy. I, I go by Birdcap. I am a muralist and illustrator by trade. I do a lot of illustrations for musicians. I've done a number of album covers and t-shirts for touring bands, and poster work and some animation work. Um, you need, I'm very much a freelance illustrator when it comes to it. I still work for a couple magazines during freelance. I'm trying to get back into doing gallery shows. I've been putting them off for a decade, but I have a solo show this January in Chicago that'll be a lot of smaller works and canvases again. I have murals in Korea, Vietnam, Thailand, Germany, uh, London, England, uh, Israel, mostly in Tel Aviv. I've painted in Chicago, Memphis, LA, Denver. I'm going to Miami next week. Painted in New York, Nashville, uh, Santa Fe, Jackson, Starkville, Brookhaven. I've painted around a good bit. It's a lot of, it's a very like, backpack greyhound lifestyle. It's funnest when you get to travel abroad. I've been wanting to come back to Brookhaven forever, but you kind of need a, a reason. Um, and we got it this time. Mississippi School of the Arts' long-term strategic goal is to build a guest artist residency program where we can bring in artists for long-term residencies and they can stay on campus and they can teach the students and hopefully create work. This year uh, we had Michael Roy who will put a mural up on our campus and he's a first year graduate and has made a living as a muralist around the world. Susan contacted me via email and then as soon as I saw it said Mississippi School of the Arts, I was like, oh yeah, I gotta do it, I gotta do it. I was excited to, to come back. Some amazing people come through and they come back here and talk to us about the, their career and their path and like just drop knowledge on us. And we're gonna get to work with him to complete the mural that's gonna be on campus. <laughs> Real practically, I tried to make a mural that I could get the kids to help with. But what they did is I drew out uh, the hieroglyphs on these sheets of paper and the kids cut them out for me. And then I showed them how to, to get it against the wall and how to paint it. But I only told them once and then they, I mean, every hieroglyph you can see there with a few exceptions, that's all high school students. Like I told them how to use the level and the tape and the measuring once and then they took it, you know, 80 feet. Um, there's some creative kids here. They're also just hardworking because they did that while going to school still. They still had homework they had to get done. They still had critiques they had to go to. And they etched out time in the day. They're like, you know what, I got 20 minutes here. And they'd run out and help. Boom, boom, boom. Um, so I'm real proud of them. I'm glad they're at this school. It's definitely like inspiring when a person who's um, gained some success sees some success in you. Like they, they see potential like as to what you could be and it's, it's, it's a great thing. I went to the Mississippi School of Arts 2004-2005. I'm an alumnus of Mississippi School of the Arts. I had no interest in, in art as a career before I came here. And now, you know, my entire yearly income is art. 
and it's all, so is my entire social community, my entire, like, when I'm off work, all I'm doing is drawing. It's, it completely absorbed every aspect of my life by a random decision to come here. It was uh, the most formative two years of my life, easy. Everything that's going cool right now in my life is because of two years in Brookhaven. My life's entirely different because of the Mississippi School of Arts, more so than because of my college or because of any career path I took. I'm incredibly humbled to, to get to do what I'm doing now. It's a career that when I was young, I didn't even know could exist. That's what MSA gave me. MSA gave me the ability to see that there were possibilities. Thanks for joining us. If you like what you see, subscribe to Mississippi Public Broadcasting. Till next time, I'll be seeing you on Mississippi Roads. Down Mississippi Roads.